Day have signed up for wine from Kevin O'Leary. You know him as Mr. Wonderful from Shark Tank. What you also need to know is that he has spent decades blending perfect wines, and reserve wines are very, very special. And tonight we bring you some choices. We're going to allow you to choose from all these different varietals, and you can choose a three bottle of any one single varietal, which a lot of people have done today, or you can go with our best value, which is your 12 bottle case. And that would also be available in all the different varietals that we're going to talk to you about tonight. It's important to know that these are reserve wines. And Kevin will join us shortly to explain to you that those are wines that are held back, reserved for special clients. And tonight, you are that special client. Now, I'm excited to be able to taste these with you tonight because our stylist has provided me with disposable wine glasses that have all been sanitized. In fact, they were just taken out of sealed sanitized packages. So I will be able to taste the wine with you tonight and we'll be able to experience all this and explain to you what each of them is all about. Now, we know that many of you are lovers of Moscato wine, a sweet wine. And we've got a three bottle offering in Moscato tonight, but do not wait on it. It has been the most popular all day long today. Now, if you also love a little rosé all day, all day, oh, hey, oh, for hey, the rosé all day, yep. We've got a three bottle set of the red rosé wine. Beautiful. Now, just in time for summer, one of my favorite wines of summertime is Sauvignon Blanc. Then I've got it for you in a beautiful Chardonnay. And then if you prefer reds, one of the most difficult wines to blend, one of the most difficult reds to blend is the Pinot Noir. And we've got a beautiful Pinot for you tonight. And then finally, from the Walla Walla Valley, the Cabernet Sauvignon. Now those are the three bottle varietals that you can order tonight, or you can go with a 12 bottle set. Now if you wanna go all sweet, that'll give you six Moscato and six of the Rosé. That's our all sweet. If you want, um, I think we're calling them bright whites, Six of the Chardonnay, six of the Sauvignon Blanc. Bold Reds give you six of the Pinot Noir and six of the Cabernet Sauvignon. That's most limited in both of our ship uh, dates, both now and May 10th. And most popular, as always is the case, is our mixed varietal. So this all happens for you, giving you two of each of the varietals we've talked about tonight. Now let's discuss our easy pay breakdown and talk to you about how this is going to work out for you. The three bottle set comparatively uh, priced at retail would be $89 tonight. We're saving you 50 bucks. It's only $39 and five payments of $7.80. 12 bottle set is $289 at retail. Tonight we save you $170 and it breaks down to about $9.92 per bottle. And that's five payments of $23.80. Now look at all of the states that we ship to thanks to all of the hard work that has gone on all these years. Only the states shaded in white are where we cannot ship this wine. We recently welcomed Oklahoma to the family. So now all of the states shaded in red, including Pennsylvania, can all deliver straight to your doorstep. Now, take a look at your choice graphic again, just so you're aware of what your offer is, and then we'll bring in Mr. Wonderful in this, our final presentation of the day. I believe we have a choice graphic, yes. Here we go. So. Choose Moscato, Rosé, Sauvignon Blanc, Chardonnay, Pinot Noir, or Cabernet Sauvignon. In the 12 bottle set, choose the sweet wines, the bright wines, the bold reds, or the mixed, which is our most popular tonight. You can have these delivered either immediately or the week of May 10th. And if you decide on auto delivery, you'll receive a new three or 12 bottle wine set, depending on what you ordered originally, every four months for not one year, but two years, and shipping and handling is included with every shipment. Nearly 26,000 have now been ordered, and that's way more than half of the quantity we brought in for the entire day. Kevin O'Leary, also known as Mr. Wonderful, joins us now live via Skype for this, his final look of the day. Kevin, it is great to have you back. Welcome to In the Kitchen with David, your kitchen reimagined. I'm so happy to be back with you, David. We always have so much fun together with wine. We've done it for years. I'm proud to be part of the sale today. Well, we're thrilled to have you here, sir, and I'm thrilled to be tasting right along with you. Let's begin with that sweet wine that is one that has been so very popular today, the three-bottle Moscato, which you can also order in that 12-bottle set. Tell us about your Moscato and what makes a reserve wine special. 
Moscato is the most popular of any of the sweet wines I make. It's been a perennial favorite ever since I brought it on QVC years ago. But I must say, with the magic of making this wine, it's 100% Moscato, the original grape harvested by the Romans that far back. But my way of making this is in stainless steel tanks. And what you're really looking for, David, is the nose, the apricots, the white peach, the apple, the honeysuckle. And then when you taste it, the pear, the mandarin orange, and that amazing lemon zest that keeps winning awards. That's what wow. you've got in Moscato, David. It tastes like a fruit bouquet, which is really mm -hmm. delightful. I like to call a Moscato a summer welcome wine. It's the one that I would serve when I was having friends over, and a nice way to greet them as they come and, and join me for the first time for the evening. Then we're going to get into rosé all day. Oh, hey, this one is the red rosé and the, something very, very special. In addition to being slightly sweet, it's incredibly popular. Tell us about it. Well, this is a really interesting wine. Everybody calls it everyday rosé, but the truth is this is a very complex personality. I've blended 12 different varietals, or sorry, seven different varietals into this. You know what that means? This wine has enough personality to talk back to you, David. It's absolutely <laughs> fantastic. Six months in stainless steel tanks. The nose is rose petals, jasmine, strawberry, and the taste, raspberries, melon, and a bold kiwi finish. People love this rosé, Dave. I can taste all those fruits. It really is fantastic. Then we're going to move into what I call one of my favorite wines of summer. This is the Sauvignon Blanc, and one that I think is so incredibly versatile. Tell us about yours. So Sauvignon Blanc, and I'm asking everyone to expand their horizons if they like white wine. If you love Chardonnay, you've got to try Sauvignon Blanc. This is 95% Sauvignon, 5% Moscato. That's how I blend it. Aged in steel tanks, the nose is peach blossoms, lemon zest, green apple, and you would expect those flavors, and you get them. In addition, lime, guava, and the finish is green apple. It's a, another award winner, David. Mm. Isn't that gorgeous? Now all I need is outdoor seating in the summertime, some wonderful uh, lights on, and smooth jazz on the stereo. That is a perfect <laughs> summer wine. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, you nailed it there. And then That's let's right. get into your Chardonnay. Now, I know your wife is a big lover of the whites and helps you out with these. Tell us more about the Chardonnay. She was the first to identify years ago that people wanted to pull back a little bit on the heavy oak, and she helped me blend this and did a fantastic job. 96% Chardonnay, 4% Vonnier. The making of this, again, it's basically pressed in stainless steel. The nose is ripe melon, pineapple, toasted oak, and you mm. should be able to taste pear, ripe peaches, and that hint of vanilla. Now, David, one thing about this shard, I have won more gold awards than any other of my wines. Gold, 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 double gold. This is a rock star wine. Yeah. This is what I would serve Love with that. seafood, a crisp green salad, a Caesar, a chicken Caesar salad, maybe a little Thai food. Whatever you love, this is going to be the perfect accompaniment with that. And Kevin, we're going to talk all about your awards because we've got a great big full page that will explain all that. I just wanted to get through all the varietals. Let's talk about your Pinot Noir. Now, this is one of the more difficult wines to blend. Tell us about this blended red. The Pinot Noir, the berry itself, the grape, is very difficult, and you've got to be very careful with it, and it's the hardest wine to make. This is 97% Pinot Noir, 3% Syrah, 10 months in French oak barrels, and then the nose should finally come out red cherry, raspberry, mm. but you want that earthy forest floor. And the taste, wild strawberry, raspberry jam, cherry, a hint of savory mushrooms. Listen, it's difficult to make this, but again, I'm so proud of this. It's a reserve. And yes, yes, it has won awards. And that's hard to do with a Pinot, David. Really hard. Woo! Is that ever good? And I've always said if you're transitioning to red for the first time, Pinot is a good uh, transition red for you. It's a nice way to introduce you. It's got a really smooth finish. You don't have all those, uh, all those rich tannins that sometimes can be a bit of a turn off with red if you're new to reds. So think about that. But now let's talk about the Big Daddy, the one I'm going to serve with my prime rib roast for Easter. Or Maybe that big New York strip steak I've got on the grill tonight. This is the Cabernet Sauvignon, and this is from the Walla Walla Valley. Yes, it is. And you know, Cabernet Sauvignon is the great American wine. Why? It's big, it's bold, it's spicy, it's fantastic with steak. It's fantastic with any great meal. But this is very special, David. Walla Walla Valley, Washington State, has some of the best terroir. That's where the, the earth is perfect to 
to bring the best Cabernet out. And I've done a blend here again. 88% Cabernet Sauvignon, 12% Merlot. Gives it that amazing finish. And it's just a wonderful blend of some of the very best cabs made in oak barrels. The nose, blackberry, cherry, warm baking spice. And when you taste it, which I'm going to have a quick sip here. I love it so much. Oh, this is Boys what I want. Boysenberry, red currant, oh, hint of chocolate, leather fig. It's all there, David, and it wins awards. I was just going to tell you about the fig. I can taste the fig. Let's talk about your reward, your awards here, Kevin, because remember, every wine is recognized with gold, silver, or bronze medals. I spy a lot of gold on this on this chart. There's tremendous accolades for every one of your wines. Yes, I'm very proud of it. The best you can do as a winemaker is treat it like an art. You're painting a picture. You're blending and you're trying to keep that reserve status. It has to be as good as your last reserve or it doesn't deserve the reserve at all. You want to make it better. But the only way to know with certainty is put it out in the market, let people taste it, let the judges decide, and bam, another award, another award. Another, look, anybody else would go to their head, David. I'm humble. I'm happy to go to work every day to make great wine. Now, 26,500 wines have been ordered for the day. That's well over half our quantity and 1,500 ordered in this show. You should be aware that all of these are award winners. Kevin, we should also explain before we go through all the varietals again that these are your reserve wines. Help us better understand a reserve wine and why that's so special. Well, reserve's a double-edged sword, David. When you declare a reserve, it's special. You hold it back. You make it a very special wine. I originally did it just for my family. Then I started putting it in the market. Here's the challenge. Once you rele re release a reserve, you can't go below that standard ever again. You have to keep raising the notch. You've got to get better and better and better every year. And the only way you can know is to put it into the competitions and find out if the judges and other people who taste the wine agree with your assessment. You've kept the standards. And I'm proud to say I have. And it's proof is in the pudding and all those awards. This is not easy work. And this is why I do it. I love the challenge. I love it. Well, Kevin, let me update you now on our three bottle varietals. And I will also remind you we're shipping either immediately or May 10th. Now, if you want the three bottle Moscato shipping now, four dozen is all I have left. If you want it shipping on May 10th, 400 left to go around. The rose wine shipping now, 300 shipping May 10th, 550. Then the Sauvignon Blanc shipping now, 1200 and then shipping 510. 800. Then we get into the Chardonnay. Shipping now, 250, and then May 10th, 650. The uh, Pinot Noir shipping now, 650 in the three bottles. Shipping 510, 750, and finally the Cabernet Sauvignon. Shipping now, 700. May 10th, 800 to go around. If you want the 12 bottle set all sweet, shipping now, 1300 to go around, and 510. 800 to go around. Then I've got your bright whites. 1,200 shipping now, 700 that I can ship out on May 10th. Then if you want the bold red, six and six, shipping now, 350, shipping on 510, 350. And finally the mix, shipping now, most popular option. 3,800 that can ship now, 2,800 that can ship on May 10th. Our value here, Kevin, is extraordinary. The three bottle set at retail would be $89. Tonight, we're about $13 per bottle, so that's about $39 for the three, five payments of $780. The 12 bottle set, $289 at retail. Tonight, we're at $119. That's $170 savings, bringing down to about $9.92 per bottle. And don't forget, there's also easy pay as well. Now, Kevin, we just lost the Moscato three bottle in the immediate ship. That has now sold out. But we also have a little video of you busy making all this happen. Talk to us about what we're seeing here. David, I travel the world. I look for the very best ideas in wine in Italy, in France, in Germany. I come back to America to my vineyards and I take the very best grapes we have and I paint the palette. I blend the wines and I blend them for the American taste so that we can really enjoy some of the greatest ideas from around the world and make them our own from Napa Valley, from Sonoma Valley, from Walla Walla. And then the reason these wines are so fantastically priced is I have no middleman. I ship them directly from the vineyard to you. I make them for my family and I ship them directly to you. They are spectacular. And the proof's in the pudding and the awards. But you save a ton of money not having to go through multiple tiers of distribution. That's the magic of what we do here, David. 
Now, you're also going to receive a guide to enjoying wine. So Kevin has put together a wonderful guide for you. I can let you know that in this show alone tonight, we've already taken over 2,000 orders. I can tell you now that's 27,000 for the day, and the price will go away tonight, Kevin. At end of day, 11:59 p.m. Eastern Time tonight is when this item.